Hey everyone, this is Snark with Snark's Domain. Today we're going to be testing K5 Pro Viscous Thermal Paste on the hot plate. So let's get to it. Alright, so I bought some of this K5 Pro after receiving a few requests to test it. So we've done that. Uh, this stuff in this package came in a little lipstick applicator and included a, a tiny popsicle stick looking thing and some documentation and uh, instructions on how to use it. So I'm just going to flip through the documentation. You guys can press pause if you need to read any of it and then we'll get right into the testing in just a moment. All right, that's it for documentation. Here is the testing time lapse. All right, so it took eight minutes and 57 seconds for the sensor block to reach 100 degrees Celsius. Uh, this puts K5 Pro as the worst performing thermal putty that I've tested so far myself. Uh, so I don't think I would recommend it as a direct replacement for thermal pads. Now it might have an application for copper shims. So I'll definitely do that testing on the hot plate, but I don't think I'm gonna be buying tons of this stuff anytime soon myself. Anyways, it was worth testing because I've seen mixed reviews online. And thanks for the suggestions from those that wanted me to test it. Uh, that's it for this video. So if uh, you found it useful, feel free to hit the like and subscribe button. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Thanks.